Yeah, today is uh, goes from a couple different formations. Uh, in the in kind of the quarterback look at how he how he's looking at things, and, and I'm also going to correct some of the receiver things that they did on this uh, deal here. Okay, so uh, first let's get our screen going here. Um, get this here, for you guys. All right, this first play, we got all goes. Um, if we look at here, we want to make sure we got four receivers in the deal here. We got double tight end situation. Uh, and there's where we're looking at. We should have a guy on the numbers, hash, hash, and numbers. When we start this play, we're going to see that this tight end goes across and gets into this tight end's territory, which kind of brings this safety into the play, which we don't really want. Um, so let's look at that right now, right out the gate. There's the play. Now, see this guy, how he's running across the field? Uh, again, he's bringing this safety into the play, and that's what we're looking to avoid. Um, if you're going to see here in a second what we want to hit, uh, this guy would have been wide open. We, we hit him quick. Uh, and I would, that would have been the money ball. Now, I, I don't have anything going against our six, you know, four receiver here trying to throw the jump ball. It's not a bad thought about it. Our backside tight end's got to know where he's going, though. We'll look at this from the end zone view here. Um, again, you'll see a great view here where if this tight end comes out wide where he's supposed to and takes his safety with him, we want to hit this guy right about five yard line to the to the end zone, and that's where we'll kind of go with that. So there's the line. Here we go. Let's look at it. Good eyes. Now again, the quarterback was going straight for where he wanted to go uh, with the jump ball, but the open guy, you know, you're going to see right here, Alex Coleman, wide open, right there. You got where we want to hit two him. guys, man. He's so, doing everything right in there. Yeah. That's, it. that's that's the money ball. Take what's open instead of what we like. Even though even though pre snap read wasn't a bad deal here. Okay, here again we go all goes out of doubles. Again, doubles makes it easy. We want hash hash pre snap read hash hash. Now, as we told you and as we've taught for years, if this guy is more than six seven yards off, we can just give these guys hitches. So right now. He gives him a hitch, and he gives him a hitch. I don't mind him keeping this a go as long as his intent is not to throw to him, but to throw this hitch. This guy's up tight, so he's going to keep the all goes on. Okay? Um, so I'm, I agree with his hitch here, and I agree with him giving the hitch here. He likes the boundary throw, which is fine. Um, the other thing that's off the screen is they have a safety who's playing middle of the field here. Okay? Uh, so we're going to pay attention to the quarterback's eyes. Takes a snap right here. Look at his eyes. Number one, his eyes are looking here. He knows he's not throwing it there. He knows he likes this guy over here. Okay. Yeah, so he's going to look here first, and then he's going to look back this way. Um, and, and that's going to be the money ball. Now, to correct and make this even better, because this receiver ran outside the numbers, okay, instead of trying to reach the hash, because technically he should be on the hash here, and this guy should be on the numbers. See how close they are? That could be a problem. If this kid was a better player, he can play both of them. Because um, we know our guy's going to run past their outside linebacker. So we finish the play here. He comes back. And again, I want this thing thrown actually a little earlier. I want him to hit it. Um, the ball should be in the air already. and going to hit it within the next 5 to 10 yards here, which I'll show on the end zone view. Um, but overall, it was, it was a nice play. We'll take anything that's a reception. The other thing, if we go back to the beginning of this play, um, and again, he knew from the start where he wanted to go. But the other the other thing that's wide open here is we got this hitch right here because the corner gets so much depth. We could take the easy hitch all day long. Now, I know it turned out good for us, so we'll go with it. But um, if we want to take the easy passes, that hitch is, is wide open. Okay. From the end zone view, we'll get a little better look at this. Uh, and this is a perfect look. We want Nooms here. We want to get him down inside of here. At least he don't have to get all the way to the hash, but he should definitely be inside on this receiver instead of outside. 
that'll push him uh, too much into Brandon, our X receiver. And if he's inside, you'll see that Ryland should throw this probably a little bit quicker here. Okay, so there it was. Look over. Boom. Get now, I want this ball right here right. on line. But, again, he should be inside. So if you imagine him right here, this thing's going to be open to hit on a line right here. And now he might get a touchdown out of this deal. Um, now, he did look the safety off. You can see he's not even in the screen right now. So that's a great job on that aspect. Uh, because of the way the route was run, he ends up putting it up over top, which is his only option. And it was actually a great throw um, and a great play. So we'll take that for sure. Now we get another look here. We got double tight again, but we got Trey. Okay, so again, we got our four here. This He's good, kind of straight on this hash, maybe a little bit outside. That's fine. Right here, hash, hash. And again, it ain't a bad idea to give this guy a hitch or even this guy a hitch. He's probably not going to run past him. you got a good six to eight yards there in between the two, about eight yards. Um, so we can give those guys hitches if we like. What I love here is a go ahead and let's play that safety. Because um, in my mind, with our pre-snap read here, and it just went past. So let me get this back here for a second. Let's get our pre-snap read. All right. With our pre-snap read, look at this corner on the line and outside. He is not going to see this guy releasing up to hash. And now we got this guy release, or he's on the numbers, and this guy is going to be right down the middle of the field. So this safety's got to play one or the other. And so what I love here is go ahead and play off of this safety and hit one of those two guys. Let's see what happens. Snap of the ball. Boom. Where's the safety go right now? He bites here. The corner's here. Here's the corner. His eyes go with the quarterback's eyes. Let's go right. Um, but since his number one read, he didn't like it right away. He kind of freezes, and then we get a scramble situation. Okay. So we like the scramble. We understand it's there. Um, but he gets a scramble situation. Good athlete. Makes a play, but we're out of bounds here. Great catch. We're out of bounds. But that should have been a touchdown. Throwing the ball on time, um, and, and it never becomes a factor. Here's from the back view. Just kind of get a quick look. Same thing as we saw. We look at number 12 here as a safety. Boom, his eyes go right to that guy. Now we want to come back and throw to the other guy. Um, again, he makes a good play. It's moving on. Um, your coach did this play wrong. It's actually a sluggo, so I'm going to move it on to all goes. We want to stay with the all go look. Uh, and this is a great doubles look, all goes. I was watching this with my eight-year-old son. He said, Dad, look it, he's not covered. And I said, you're right, he's not covered. Look at how much this guy's inside. Uh, so we got our, our go routes again. If we look at uh, where we're going here, we're on the numbers, we're on the hash, we're on the hash, and we're on the numbers. Again, I'd give this guy a hitch. This guy is obviously playing about eight yards off the ball. Give that outside guy a hitch so that this guy doesn't get into that wide open grass that we were looking at. This guy can keep his go route on, and I would probably give this guy a hitch also. Um, you know, he's probably about six to seven, but it's, it's it, it depends what we want to get here. Um, although 11 could probably. This guy, if you see anything else, I don't, I, there's nothing else out there. That's, that's the money ball. Okay. Obviously, your great coach saw the same thing. We look to the sideline, get the play. Hey, let's run all goes. Probably yelling Aiden Thomas, Aiden Thomas. Okay. We get the snap. Where's his eyes? Eyes go right over here. Um, we Right here, we see... Ah, here we go. We're going to show this. You see the safety come into play right here, okay? Um, the safety is right here. There's the safety. He's on this hash. So that's another reason why we love this. He's already on the hash. We have all this field to play with. There's no way he can make it over there. Even so, eyes go that way. He comes back to where he wants to throw it. Now, again, in my eyes, I like the harder throw about right here with some, with some uh, velocity on it. Um, 
and I like him being a little bit more tighter. But Ryland says, you know what? He's so open. We're just going to put it up over top, and that's fine. You get the touchdown throw, money ball. To the hitch on the outside would have been nice. Yeah. And, and so, you know, we go back here. Coach is with me. That outside hitch again, like we should have, we should have gave the outside guy a hitch. Because now, now he can put it on the outside shoulder, number two, right? Yeah, yeah. And this guy, this corner is playing terribly. Yeah. But, um, this hitch right here is what we should have. It would have been nice and wide open. And a good corner would should be playing this thing in the middle here, and he's not. Um, just getting depth. So I love, I love when you know you like that inside fade. Go ahead and give an outside hitch, even if. You're not going to throw it. I know that's a long throw for a hitch, but it would be very so open. It doesn't really matter. We look at it this view, and, and again, on this view, the key is, hey, quarterback knows what he likes. Um, and then when we snap the ball here, you're going to see safety. you're going to see the safety go. So from this view, what I love, and let's see if it stops on its own. Boom, stop for me. Good. There's that safety. He just he looks with the quarterback's eyes. Now the quarterback looked back, and he's his eyes are still on this inside still, receiver. That's a huge that look off big for quarterback, you know. And uh, and again, we're money on the deep ball. Hey, look at that. Hey, why not look at a little effort play here? Smile getting a block. Or smile. Or other receiver says, "Hey, let me just get in his way." It's nothing stupid. He doesn't hit the guy hard. He just gets in his way to make sure that guy doesn't. Catch our receiver. Really? It's awesome. So it's a good good little effort, extra effort play on that deal. That's it. Okay. Minus, minus the screen now. All right. So for today, for now, hey, for today, for now, that's you've got your key points. We want a pre-snap read. We want to say who are we giving hitches to and who are we giving fades to. Um, and on all goes, if it's one of the middle two routes, as we just showed you, we want to. get a good matchup, um, and that can be an over-the-top throw a little bit deeper. Uh, thank you for the session today. And I always say, uh, I always say, arrow out. <laughs>